and I watch the big bridging truck go past me. And I drive in here and I see another bridging truck with a couple volunteers climbing in that truck. And I thought, this here little quote that I have from Dr. Martin Luther King, I think that says it all. <clears throat> Life's most persistent and urgent question is, what are you doing for others? What are you doing for others? Well, you know, this 93-year-old man comes here every day, and I watch what you people do. And then I pick up the paper this morning, and here's the headline here. Hate crimes report rise sharply for the third year. Now, there's so much hate in this world but what I experience when I walk through these doors is love. And I see that every single day here by what you people do. And love will always conquer that headline there. Always it will conquer that. And you guys, you just make it happen. I watch, just this week I watched an elderly lady in a wheelchair. And two of you wonderful volunteers took that woman through. And I, I just thought, that looks like a mother hen with her chicks. And <laughs> they just followed her through. And to, uh, to watch that is just, well, a lot of times it makes me cry. <laughs> but I want to tell you one story that happened to me. I'm sitting in that chair out there by the door, I think it was a week ago, Friday. And this woman was picking up her stuff. And she had a sweatshirt on. And it said, nobody cares. Nobody cares. So I called her over and I said to her, I don't like what your sweatshirt says, because I care about you. And she just lost it, <laughs> gave me a hug, and there was quite a few tears shed there too. So I mean, we can do this, and you guys, what I see, I, I, I just can't express my love for all of you. You're looking at an old man that is living his dream, okay? Listen to these words. Hold fast to dreams, for if dreams die, life is a broken-winged bird that cannot fly. So by what you do here, that personifies right there. I'm living my dream, and you are all part of it. And because of that, it is very easy for me to say, from the bottom of this old man's heart, I love you. <laughs> and always remember that this old man loves you very dearly. Thank you for what you do. Thank you, Grant.